students today we are going to do an activity of maths on the topic algebraic identity in this we are going to prove an identity which is really very important and it is your first identity that is a plus b whole square is equals to a square plus 2ab plus b square to prove this we are going to use some material and that is square craft papers and you can use any colorful paper like this and I have took three different colorful papers this orange and this gray color and this pink color I am using and next is a pair of scissor for cutting the paper I have used this scissor geometry box I have written because we are using pencil eraser scale and any colorful pens so these I am including in geometry box and thus is a glue stick so to paste anything we are going to use this glue stick now next is observation that we are going to write after doing this activity so for this first of all I am taking the orange paper you can take any color paper and then I am taking 8 centimeter length and going to cut the square piece with the side 8 like this so you can cut like this so we got this square with the side 8 centimeter and that 8 we are taking a a equals to 8 I am taking here next I am going to cut another smaller square piece with length 5 means the side of the square will be 5 and then we are going to cut this like this we got this we get this now lastly we are going to cut two rectangular pieces of breadth 5 and length as 8 centimeters and we can cut like this the two rectangular pieces So now you can see our these four pieces is ready are already ready one is a square with side 8 centimeter that I am denoting A as 8 I am saying this is as A I am writing the side is A here fine giving the name and next is the square with the 5 centimeter side I am taking it as B giving the name as B you can see now and the rectangle which we have taken the length as A and breadth as B I am taking ok even I am writing here that I am taking here A equals to 8 and B equals to 5 say so we are taking like that now we have to arrange these four pieces in a manner so that we can get a big square so how we can arrange let us see I am putting this here and uh, you can put the second one here it's up to you next one I am putting here and the last one I am putting here ok you can paste these pieces with the fevi stick you can take the fevi stick you can paste like this now you can see I have pasted all the four pieces now it becomes a square how 
because what is a square if all the four sides are equal then it becomes a square so now you can see we have cut this as a this is a we have taken so i can write here this is a this is b already written b so i'm writing this a and this is b so the complete side will become a plus b okay and this is also a and this is b so complete it is also become b plus a and a plus b the same thing and the this side again a plus b you know this is a square piece with the side a and this rectangle this is the breadth having b and similarly this is also a plus b so all the four sides of the square are a plus b so it becomes a big square and now you can think of what is the area of this bigger square the area of this bigger square will become a plus b whole square yes and you can write now the observation what we have observed that the area of the bigger square that we have made that is a plus b whole square how we have made the bigger square by using the four pieces so what are the four pieces the area of this orange piece is a square okay so a square now second we have taken two rectangular pieces that is ab the area is ab here and this is also having the area ab so we can write ab plus ab and then this is the smaller square which is having the area as b square so b square okay so after solving we can just add these two ab's so it become 2 ab plus b square and it is same so now you can see what was our objective a plus b whole square equal to a square plus 2 ab plus b square and this is the result so in this way we can prove that why these two things are equal so i hope you really enjoy this video and in this way by this activity you can remember that why this identity is like this and you can do the activity in the same manner thank you